this is what my hair's looking like at the moment. It is definitely a little bit worn out. That is shocking, oh my god. Hey people, welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to refresh your passion twists after you've had them in for a couple of weeks. I've had these in for just over two weeks now and it is time that I redid them. So if you haven't seen my video on how I installed these, just click the link above. And if you have seen the video, continue watching. Okay, so for your refresh, you're going to need some tools and some products. So the first thing you need to have is your spray bottle of water. You need some sort of leave-in to apply to your normal hair. I've got the Jamaican Black Castor Oil as I am leave-in conditioner. I'm using the Intense Hydrating Argan Oil by Pantene and I've got my Let's Jam. This is a conditioning and shine gel. If you are doing the crochet method, you're going to need your crochet needle. I'm not going to be doing that today, I'm just going to be doing the braiding method um, just because I want to limit the use of the rubber bands because they are a little bit annoying when they keep falling out of your hair and snapping. I'm going to be putting these black rubber bands onto the ends of my hair to keep it in. This is what my hair's looking like at the moment. It is definitely um, a little bit worn out so I'm going to be redoing the edges of my hair and the perimeter down the middle just because I've got um, a few bits that if you can see here slip down from the actual braid i'm going to start by just spraying these edges because i want to try and get my edges in with um the style when i redo it and literally this is the only way it saved me is by doing my edges because they'd be looking wild so i'm just going to start by doing the perimeter first um, this one isn't actually that bad because I literally did it, redid it today at work, but I didn't refresh it and put any conditioner on, so I'm just going to start with this one right here. And if your hair is okay, you don't want to, you don't actually need to use any additional hair, you can just use what's already there. I'm just going to give this a little bit of a spray because I haven't really been moisturising it too much when it's been in the passion twist. Just give it a little bit of moisture. I'm using the LCO method. I always do LCO whenever I'm moisturizing my hair. Take some of this and you wanna just put it around the patterns around the edges make sure your grip is nice and tight grab some more of the let's jam and just make sure you're adding this as you go down your hair just to keep the ends in and to keep it um, from going frizzy looks so much better. The back is horrendous. I've got some coming out but we're gonna fix that up. And the good thing about these is you actually don't need to add more hair unless you want to like I'm just using the hair that was already in.
Okay, so I've just seen um, a few at the back that are a little bit worse for wear, like this one. This is awful. But I'm just gonna redo a couple at the back, see how we go. grip the back I don't know why but I tend to get a better grip when I do the back of my head which is weird because I can't even see anything but I guess it's a good thing I'm just cut it down a little bit more do you know what? it's so tempting to just do the whole of my head it's so annoying I hate having bits that are that are like really messy and frizzy and bits that are nice yeah i definitely need to redo this one this one is looking disgusting see the frizz and this is the last one i'm gonna do because i am done with doing this now oh this has done it as well i've got this like oh, awful bit of dirt or something what is that well this is terrible as well i need to do that one Nah, this is gonna be my last one. That is shocking, oh my god. Shocking. I'm just gonna put these two together underneath. I got it out because it's disgusting. than I needed to but I'm a perfectionist so hopefully this will last me another I don't know I want to say two weeks but let's not be ambitious I'm just going for another week um, of this before I um, decide to take it out but this is what it's looking like at the moment much better than before there's no frizz anymore it's looking good it's looking good what i need to do is i need to set it again and i might even put some accessories in it texture my way styling and setting foam and just set it again this pink um spritz this is just for a little bit more hold hope you enjoyed the video make sure you subscribe to my channel to see more hair tutorials and fitness tips from me i will see you next time <laughs>